name is Eli Apple, uh, cornerback for Ohio State, and I'm training at Exos in San Diego, California. I was born in Philadelphia, and I moved around a little bit when I was uh, a kid, and then I settled in New Jersey. My stepdad, he's kind of really been my real dad like my whole life, and I didn't know that you know he wasn't my real dad until like middle school. He's the reason why I love football, because he was a big fan. He was a huge Eagles fan, and he always talked about football. He used to always uh, help me train. He used to push me more than anybody when I didn't want to go out and practice or do things. He would always be the, be the um, motivational person in my ear, like, hey, it's time to go out and get some work in. So he's always been there. Uh, I couldn't say enough about him. When I came to college, I just really wanted to honor, honor my stepdad. So by changing my name, I felt that I could really uh, you know, honor him. Plus, that's something I always wanted to do. And I felt when I got to college, it was the time to do that. Uh, training for the combine here has definitely been long and grueling. It's been kind of tough, but I'm having fun with it. Exos to me, I think they have everything, and they've definitely helped me get faster. And the coaches, uh, Brent, he's very motivational. You know, all the guys are just trying to help everybody out and stay accountable. Just talking to some of the receivers about different things, different techniques at the line of scrimmage. Uh, I've talked to guys like Josh Doxson, he's a very good receiver, and then uh, Aaron Burbage as well. He's also uh, has some pretty good tips about uh, pressing and stuff like that. And then the other corners, uh, Larry Scott from Oregon State, and then uh, Lloyd, he's from Arizona State. He had a couple of nice techniques with, uh, you know, break and drive, the T-step, you know. Everybody's kind of taught differently growing up, so just to hear a little bit of everything from different people helped me a lot. It's a great environment. It's really fun for me as a coach uh, to watch our athletes at the end of a game on opposing sidelines get together and exchange jerseys at the end of a game or, or, or shake hands and, and uh, you know, have some kind words to say to each other because they train together. Of course, we all want to get drafted high as possible and we're all working really hard towards that, but at the same time, we're also having fun with it. Eli's just so quick. That's the fun thing about Eli is when he puts his foot in the ground to go from one spot to the next, it's instantaneous. And you talk about a kid who, who comes in and um, and is, is probably sitting at 5.5% body fat. So when you have somebody who looks like that um, and, and that type of build on him uh, and then has the, you know, the ball skills to play in space like he does, uh, you know you've got a, a gifted athlete. Uh, it's Eli Apple, Ohio State Corner, and you're watching Stack.